The life of a UK equity active fund manager was incredibly challenging in 2016. The relative performance was extremely weak, and I'd go as far to say it's one of the worst years, if not the worst year, I've witnessed within my career. Now, there's many reasons as to why this was. One, the Brexit vote. Um, sterling weakness certainly supported international type companies, companies that are orientated towards exporting. These are typically the largest companies in the index and an area that many UK active fund managers are actually underweight. The second reason I'd point to is the oil price recovery. A sharp um, recovery in the oil price led to many energy companies outperforming too. And again, another area that UK equity managers were underweight. The good news is that actually 2017, we've seen a much better performance backdrop from these UK equity fund managers. And one, that's somewhat a reversal of what we've just spoken through, but also I'd highlight that stock dispersions being higher and fundamentals reasserting themselves has meant it's been a better market backdrop for bottom-up stock selectors. Now the passive active debate continues as ever and we do a lot of work here in Morningstar but the one thing I would say is with fees becoming a little bit lower and also a concentration within the um, sector group with actually we can now see within the last couple of years about 10 to 20 percent of the sector consolidating so fewer UK equity managers out there although there is still a vast number of funds to choose from but I think going forward what's going to be important is if you pick an active manager it needs to be active and it needs to differentiate itself in some way. What that does mean is there will be volatility along your performance profile and that's something I think investors need to understand.